Tonight, infuriated parents confronted school leaders after they suddenly learned that their children's school is shutting down. WBZ's Tammy Mutasa spoke to families at St. Joseph's Prep in Brighton who are now worried about their kids' education. Tonight, some parents were outraged and in tears. They feel blindsided by the school closing and wonder what's going to happen to their kids and what went wrong. Pretty sad. <clears throat> 137 years of memories, tradition, and a home away from home. Yet St. Joseph's Prep School will close for good at the end of this academic year in June. We didn't know this would happen Friday. We just got a call saying that there would be a notification at around 3.30 that day, and suddenly we found out the school was going to be closed. We thought we'd have a home for four years, so it's frustrating. Parents feeling like the rug was pulled out from underneath them. Sandra Scully drives her sophomore son 45 minutes to school each day. It was shocking to everyone. Everyone was devastated, you know, some sadness, then some anger and kind of a roller coaster of emotions the whole weekend. Parents flocked to the school Monday night, hoping to get more clarity on the financial challenges the Board of Trustees cited as the decision to close. We weren't allowed in the meeting, but leaders say they couldn't find a strategic partner who could support the school long term. I want to know why they didn't let us know earlier. You know, why didn't they didn't give us more advance warning uh, because most of the schools are already through their process of taking in the kids that they're going to take in. Parents say other Catholic schools in the area are stepping up, extending their deadlines for students to apply. The Duffies have a junior who's losing out on his senior year. When they were supposed to focus on college applications, now they have to get new, used to a new school. In a letter to the school community, the board said, as devastating as closing this 137-year-old institution is, we will work to ensure that this process is one that conveys the maximum possible respect and support for everyone whose lives and careers are impacted. What are you going to do? <laughs> Just move along. That's yeah. about it. That's all you can do. And some parents aren't ready to give up. There is a Save St. Joseph's Prep social media page that is gaining momentum in the community. In Brighton, Tammy Mutasa, WBZ News. Well, here at WBZ, 